Howdy doody guys, we're back. Okay, so we're doing another walkthrough this morning. This is on St. Germain, just east of Avenue Road. So we were just in the Bedford Park area. This is actually on the other side of Avenue Road, closer to Young Street. This is called the John Wanless neighborhood. So it's very sought after because people want to come here for a couple of reasons. First of all, you're very close to Young and Lawrence subway line. So people who work downtown, very easy to jump on the subway, rush downtown, get to work. Also, what's really important about this neighborhood is the school district. So John Wanless is considered one of the best schools in the area, if not the city. That's the elementary school. And it also feeds the Lawrence Park Collegiate, which is the local high school, also considered one of the best in town. Anyway, this is a terrific house just east of Avenue Road. It's number 414 St. Germain Avenue. So again, just north of Fairlawn, east of Avenue Road. It's on a 25 by 150 foot uh, depth. And it is a great property, as you can see here. We've got great space inside. It's over 2,500 square feet uh, above grade. Great finishes. Again, this house is, uh, it's its not brand new. It's an, it, its a little bit of an older new build, but as you'll see inside, the owners have taken such immaculate care of the property. It really shows like it's almost new as well. It's, it's literally turnkey, move in, you need no updating whatsoever. Anyway, come on. In. So we have outside a one car built in garage. What's cool about this as well is this house was built before the new bylaws where all the garages were built above grade. So what's cool is you don't lose any square footage from your main floor. It goes below ground, which means your main floor is much larger. Okay, we're gonna mask up because people live here. Okay, come on inside. So come have a look. Gorgeous finishes, paneling, very high ceilings. You've got 10 foot ceiling, 10 foot ceilings on the main floor. You've got this gorgeous like Jatoba cherry hardwood floors everywhere. Wainscoting paneling throughout. Fireplace right when you walk in for winter days. Have a, I, I know it's hard to see from the camera, but just to get a feel for how large this place is. Opens up into a huge kitchen, eat-in kitchen. Great granite countertops, and I love how it's open to the family room as well. So what's cool about this is you've got open concept cooking, really cute little breakfast nook as well, opening into a family room, and we can show you pictures afterwards, but it opens up into a huge backyard. This is 150 feet of depth. So what's cool about that is in this neighborhood, that is the deepest of the deepest of the lots. 150 feet in the backyard. You can even, on a 25 foot, you can even have a pool in the backyard. It's so deep, it's not, not an issue at all. We have actually clients on 25 by 150s who put tools in the backyard. Anyway, come on upstairs. Let's take a look upstairs quickly. We've got wainscoting throughout all the way up the stairs. Heart, pot, uh, pot lighting. Gorgeous crown molding. We've got a really great skylight here as well. If you can see the, the light cascading down from above. What I love about this place as well is the mastery is enormous. So as you see when I walk in here, you've got like a huge sort of like entrance way into the master itself. You've got a really large master ensuite. It is uh, a six piece ensuite, ceramic tiling. It's, it's really, really exquisite, okay? Great high ceiling height as well, which I also like about this. A lot of these houses on the second floor, the ceiling heights aren't as high. On this one, again, you're close to 10 feet with the coffering. The, the master bedroom is coffered, and you've really got another great size bedroom here also. So to finish off this house, we have two more bedrooms upstairs. Really good, generous bedrooms for kids, or an office if you wish. Great sizes. Plus a very large ensuite to share for the children. And what I love about this too is the basement. Laundry, it has a guest room, it has a large rec room, and again, the reason you're getting such the grandeur of this house is it's, it's a really interesting little trick. But again, because that garage is below the, the main floor, you really have this much generous more house. Like even though again, it's 25 feet of frontage, it's, it's hard to see from the pictures, but it really feels like it's a 30 footer because again, you're on such a deep lot and the garage is below. So it breathes like a 30 foot lot. Anyway, come with any questions.
as you can see, 414 St. Germain Avenue. Shows really well. We just put it on the market this past week. Come have a look, and I'll talk to you soon.